Watching SABC News Prime Time. Charges have been temporarily withdrawn against at least 20 protesters who were arrested at Wits University on Friday. The group appeared in the Hillbrow Magistrates Court this morning. That's good to the state suspended their prosecution to allow for further investigation into the charges against them. They were arrested on Friday and released without bail on the same day. They allegedly violated a court interdict that barred any disruptions on campus. Last week, a university bus was set alight near Witz's Parktown campus. In Tswane, ironing out issues. The insourcing task team accuses Tswane University of Technology's management team of renegating on a signed agreement between them. This because some workers were fired last week. Workers have threatened to resume their protest if the situation doesn't change. At the University of the Free State, students have vowed to shut down campus. At least 44 students and workers were arrested following protests over outsourcing. Students say their grievances had fallen on deaf ears. They accuse management of not sticking to their promises made last year. I'm saying that we're not going anywhere until the management, the university management, um, adheres to what we say. Among their demands, a minimum salary of at least 5,000 rand a month for workers. Matlaku Komane, SABC News, Johannesburg.